Honestly, some of the best writers I've had have self-identified. I feel lucky to work with such bright young people, and I hate the stigma they often get from faculty. Well, there has to be a balance between accommodating students' special needs and the needs of the rest of the class, especially when uh, safety is a factor. I have a bright student who stims in class and have noticed other students looking curiously. I'm not certain what to say, if anything. I have some students with autism who are high performing, but take up a lot of airspace. I admit I sometimes get irritated. I'm sometimes skeptical, and I wonder to what extent some students exaggerate the need for special services. There are no extra resources for teachers who have students with autism in their classrooms. Something has to change. I'm not sure what to do about students that I think may benefit from accommodations but haven't disclosed. I don't want to trespass on their privacy or offend them. Students with autism contribute a lot precisely because they think differently. 